Dr. Lawrence Marawa is with us talking about the treatment of knee pain using total joint replacement. Dr. Marawa, what is the recovery like after surgery? Well, the first of all, the hospitalization averages about three days uh, from the time of surgery. And then the patients have an option, depending upon their circumstance, age, body habitus. Some people will go to a subacute unit, uh, which we do have at Heritage Hospital, and it's a wonderful unit where they'll get rehab about three times a day. The other that option- That sounds like a lot. Aren't these people in pain? Well, if, if they work hard, the pain goes away quickly. Believe it or not, the motion and activity does decrease pain quicker than if you were to just lay in bed and wait for it to go away. So, so we encourage them to get up. If I have three times a day, I'm, I'm back. Right. We encourage them to get up the day of surgery. Most of our patients, if they're done early in the day, will get up the day of surgery. If not, definitely the day after. The other thing that happens, if they have a good support group at home, they will go home and we'll send therapy to their house, a therapist in that form, to get them exercising and get them going. And they do need to do exercises in between. So that's kind of the broad scope. To get over this, and get your range of motion back is about three months, really. It, uh, you, you're active within a period of a few weeks, but to really get the full range of motion, feel comfortable, wound healed, so you feel it's uh, functioning as you should, takes about three months. And most people at that point in time have their range of motion back, their strength back, and they're doing quite well, ambulating independently. And that's about the time they start saying, gee, I wish I had done this ages ago. That's exactly right. When they turn out well, they turn out very well because, again, that magic thing that we talked about earlier, their pain is gone pain is and they're gone. comfortable. And that total joints do very well. They relieve the pain. Now, Dr. Morrell, you had a patient who did something that's not terribly common, but she had both knees replaced simultaneously. And our crews visited with your patient so let's take a look and see how she's doing. Okay. Thank you, Mary. I'm here today at the home of Linda Jokinen, who will share with us from a patient's perspective what knee surgery is all about. Linda, thank you for inviting us into your home today. You had knee replacement surgery. How long ago was that? A year and a half. What kind of symptoms were you having? Mostly chronic knee pain. My knees felt like they were going to give out. Started with my right knee, and then I compensated so much with my left knee, then my left knee went bad. So I was limping a lot, I couldn't go up and down stairs. It was hard to mow the grass, take my grandkids for walks. I couldn't pick them up and carry them because I was afraid I'd fall. So it just changes your whole life. So there came a day when you determined that you needed to look at knee replacement surgery. Yeah, my son's wedding. Okay. I was just miserable. You know, my knees hurt, the temperature was cold when we had the reception, and that made my knees hurt worse. I couldn't dance with my son. You know, I tried, but it was very painful. Dr. Morawa did your surgery. What made you select Dr. Morawa? I've worked with Dr. Morawa since he started at Heritage about 10 years ago. And I like the work he does. He started the computer navigation, and I've done com the computer navigation with him since he started. Um, I trust his work. Great. And he's, just, he's a great surgeon. So. The days after knee replacement surgery, you had the surgery, and a couple of days after, what was it like? Um, you know, it's like childbirth, you forget. <laughs> you know, it is painful, but you have to get up, you have to move, you have to go to physical therapy, and they start you right away the next day. Right. And once you start moving, it's not as bad as you think it's going to be. I was back to work in exactly 12 weeks. I only used a cane maybe for two or three weeks, kept leaving it everywhere. I used a walker for me one day. Great. You know, so um, I, I think it went really fast, really well. Okay. And how do you feel now? I feel great. You know, I work every day. I can do my job now. I don't stand there thinking about my knees, how much they hurt, or shifting from one leg to the next. I watch my grandkids. We go to the park. You know, I take the dog for walks. I don't have any pain. You know, I have no complaints about them at all. What would you say to someone who might be watching the program who was experiencing knee pain? I would tell them to have it checked out by a surgeon and not to be afraid. I was really afraid to have surgery, but I'm really glad I did it, and I work in surgery. And then don't be afraid to have a total knee if you need it. It changes your whole life. Dr. Morawa, your patient, Linda, seems like a great gal. Tell us about her. Well, she is a great gal. She's one of our nurses in the operating room at Heritage, and uh, she worked very hard, and that's what I stress. You know, the therapy part of this is critical and Linda worked really hard and, and because of that she gave herself a great result which is helpful to us as surgeons. We can put the knee in well but if the patient doesn't work hard which is a big part of this uh, they don't do as well and so Linda worked hard and she's had a great result and is very happy. 
Now I know someone is watching us right now who's living with pain, maybe taking aspirin to try to alleviate it. What would you say to that viewer right now about their knee pain? Well, the thing I think that's important is for people with knee pain is to get an opinion, and frequently from an orthopedic surgeon. We have a wonderful group of orthopedic surgeons at Oakwood Hospital across the board, all very well educated, all very talented, and all can do these procedures very well. Get an opinion and learn what your options are. You know, ignorance is not bliss. You need to know what's going on and what you can do. And if you do need a total joint with a newer technology, there certainly is an option for you that can certainly help you and make your lifestyle a lot better and enjoy the time you have. And so I would say get an opinion and then your decision can be made based upon information, not fear. Well, Dr. Morawa, you are the absolute expert on these matters. Thank you so much for being with us today. You're welcome, thank you. And as Dr. Morawa suggested, you can get information about joint pain through Oakwood Healthcare's Joint Class 101 with convenient times and dates for that class and locations, and you'll find the listing on oakwood.org. Thank you so much for being with us on Champions of Care today. We wish you good health, and we thank you for tuning in.